Learning and memory are essential brain functions that enable us to find our car in the parking lot or recall a person's name. Neurons in specific brain regions create memories in response to a variety of experiences. However, some aspects of memory formation remain a mystery. A new study has increased our understanding of how new memories are produced by revealing that the neuronal protein LSD1N contributes to memory formation at the cellular level. Memory production involves the transcription of genes encoded by DNA, which is wrapped around a complex of proteins called histones to form chromatin. A DNA region that is wound around a histone complex is shielded from the gene transcription machinery. To control gene transcription, chemical modifications such as methyl groups can be attached to or removed from exposed regions of histones in the chromatin structure. Depending on the methylation site on the histone, these modifications can either increase or decrease the accessibility of DNA, ultimately increasing or decreasing gene transcription from the associated DNA region. This regulatory process is known to be involved in memory formation, but the sites of histone methylation and the enzymes enabling these modifications during memory formation were previously unknown. This study compared the neuron-specific protein LSD1N with its very similar version LSD1C, which is expressed throughout the body. These two enzymes remove methyl groups from histones to regulate gene transcription. Interestingly, the author showed that LSD1N removes methyl groups from lysine 20 on histone H4, in contrast to LSD1C, which targets methyl groups on lysine 4 or lysine 9 of histone H3. Methylation at lysine 20 of histone H4 suppressed gene transcription. LSD1N removed these methyl groups and promoted gene transcription. Stimulating the activity of neurons increased the transcription of hundreds of genes in wild-type neurons, but far fewer genes were upregulated in neurons lacking LSD1N. At the behavioral level, LSD1N knockout mice were less able to distinguish novel objects from familiar objects or to remember the location of an exit from a maze suggesting that the lack of LSD1N function caused defects in learning and memory processes. Taken together, these results show that neuronal stimulation activates LSD1N to remove methyl groups from specific histone sites, which facilitates the transcription of a multitude of genes that are thought to support memory formation. Future studies are needed to test whether LSD1N activity is reduced in people with memory disorders such as Alzheimer's disease or schizophrenia, and to determine whether LSD1N is involved in other neuronal functions.